Crumb Catcher Comedy Director, Chris Scotchdepole Stars, Rigo Garay as Shane, Ella Ray Peck as Leah, Lorraine Ferris as Rose Leah, Ella Ray Peck, and Shane, Rigo Garay pose for their wedding photographer, struggling to conjure up the emotions of a couple about to embark on their happily ever after. The photographer goads them with questions, trying to inspire them to smile and laugh and act like they're in love for the money shot, and it's through these stiff, stilted answers that Scotchdepole introduces the first sign of trouble in their whirlwind romance. Leah works for the publishing house that is set to publish Shane's novel, which is based on his absent from the wedding father, and it's clearly driven a wedge between them that Leah is oblivious to. With the first few scenes of the film, it's nearly impossible to discern what direction Crumb Catcher is headed. After a wedding cake mix-up, during their wedding that neither Leah nor Shane seem entirely bothered about, John makes it his life's mission to make it right, for his own, psychotic reasons. He tracks them down to the remote house that Leah's editor has gifted to them for their honeymoon, strong arms his way inside with his partner in crime Rose, Lorraine Ferris, and turns their honeymoon into all-out hell. What do you mean? That there's a car in the driveway. <laughs> Scotch Depole's script is incredibly clever with the way it drops breadcrumb clues about the characters but sometimes the breadcrumbs lead to questions, rather than answers. While Peck and Garay are stupendous actors who play off each other quite nicely, the script frames their relationship as cold and ill-matched romantically. This narrative choice makes it difficult to sympathize with either of them or even root for their survival, which also, ultimately, aids in making the film a wholly uncomfortable experience from start to bitter finish. With a runtime of around 98 minutes, Crumb Catcher doesn't have a lot of time to develop its characters beyond the bare necessities. John is a cartoonishly frantic and deranged man, who seems entirely detached from reality, while Rose is just his Vanna White in a red dress, whose motives are largely unknown to the audience. Despite its nearly fatal flaws, Crumb Catcher is an insanely impressive directorial feature debut for Scotchdepole. It's funny, bizarre, uncomfortable, and an absolute cringe fest for all the best reasons. Scotchdepole has secured himself as a writer director to keep an eye on, as he continues to refine his skill and explore the depths of depravity with a clever, humorous voice. IMDb 6.8 Metascore 52 Rotten Tomatoes, 74. Pros. The film is clever in how it drops breadcrumb clues about its characters. It is a wholly uncomfortable experience from start to bitter finish. The film explores the depths of depravity with a clever, humorous voice. Cons. It often provides questions rather than answers, reducing some of the characters to being more shallow and creating a rather flat reveal. I want you two to take a journey together. 